now transition over to our sounders here uh, on the 22nd big blow to the sounders front office as gm and president of soccer operations garth lagerway was named the president and ceo of atlanta united uh the t- club announced that garth lagerway is its new president and chief executive officer lagerway has served as the sounders fc general manager and president of soccer since 2015 helping acquire the 2016 and 19 mls cups as well as the 2022 Concacaf champions league title lagerway was also recently named the best executive by the world football summit now this is really sort of it's an interesting piece of information i know that some had seen this move coming others were blindsided by it some are angry it makes sense for Lagerway simply because of the CEO part of it. Lagerway is able to get more control of that club than he ever would have with the Sounders. I know that that's something that he's Lagerway has talked about, you know, getting this club built up to the Club World Cup, and he's done that now. He's kind of accomplished what he's wanted to with the MLS Cups, with CCL. Um, and I know that there's no ill will in that. I know there was rumors that he would have left even last season. So to get these sort of power and control that he's going to get with Atlanta. He was never going to get that with Seattle. So it makes total sense for him to leave. Unfortunately, Um, it's just where the Sounders turn now. You can't, you know, whenever a move like this happens, I try not to dwell on it. Try not to say, Oh, he's gone. It's now, what do we do next? What's our next response to a move like this? So a big hole is needed to be filled with general manager and president of soccer. Um, I would not doubt that Seattle looks inward to another local to, to a local piece to fix that. Craig Weibel, uh, Seattle sporting director and senior vice president of soccer, is the obvious choice, whether it be for interim or for the permanent spot. Considering the latter of his two roles, uh, it's going to be tough to sort of fill that role. But considering that. Wable has spent time under Lagerway, not only here in Seattle, but also back when the two were at Real Salt Lake. He makes total sense. He's a native to Portland. He went to school in Spokane. He's a University of Washington graduate. So when you come to local flavor, so to say, Craig fits that role perfectly. And you talk about experience and sort of knowledge, plus the connection to Lagerway. At least in the interim, that's who I fully expect to take over that position for the Sounders. So it's it's a tough move losing someone in a, a recently voted by World Soccer, uh, the World Football Summit, pardon me, uh, as the best executive. Uh, tough to lose that, someone who is integral in making the Sounders roster what it is, keeping them competitive year in and year out. But all things come to an end, you know, at the end of the day. So it's tough to lose, but... Seattle now has to look forward and see what their next move will be in replacing him and getting ready for a big season in 2023, trying to get back to the playoffs. He's got a club world cup still hopefully to play against some of the greatest clubs in the world and just trying to not while trying to stay competitive while building for the future. So that's a big task at hand. It should be an attractive job to those who are looking at it. Um, Just really like, Whoa, uh, I was a little bit surprised by it, not only considering the move and how Lego Way has really liked this area and this club, but also knowing that uh, when the Sounders had their uh, sort of club meeting uh, just a few weeks ago, that there was no offer by Atlanta then. It all took place over the last weekend, which is pretty wild. So we look at some league-related notes here. This isn't exactly a new thing, but sort of uh, remains fresh as Messi is in the World Cup. On November 27th, it was announced that Leo, Lionel Messi is close to an agreement to join uh, Miami, Inter Miami FC, at the end of the 2022-2023 European season. He's also rumored to be uh, joined by Sergio Biscuits um, at Inter Miami, which would you know make that club better uh, and draw some more eyes to MLS. But none of it's official yet. The my messy move has been rumored for 
perhaps a few years now. But uh, when it happens, it'll be official and we'll go over it then. But for now, technically, that is just a rumor.